So part 3 we start some harder sum from section formula. The very first sum if you see we continue with one sum I saw nice about midpoint formula. Question 7 A and B is given you can see we use here M and N. So A and B are two points and P is the midpoint whose coordinate is this. So we have to find the values of of M and N. So see here, first we can solve together or we can take one at a time. So let us take Px, x1 only first part. Okay, we can solve both together but it think I think it's easier if we do separately. Px here is 1, x, x1 is 3m, x2 is minus 4 divided by 2. 2 comes here. 2 is minus 3m minus 4. 4 comes here. 3m is 2 plus 4. We have 3m. Put imply sign is equal to 6. m is 6 by 3. 2. So first we solve for m. Now we will solve for next values y y1 plus y2 by 2 y is m minus this is children x y this is x2 y2 x1 y1 2m y1 is Two goes of children, so this becomes four m. Now here, if you see m is two, we substitute the value of m. Eight minus two is six, so this six comes here. So n is zero. Okay, children. So finally, at the end, you write m is two, n is zero. Answer. So here, yeah, what we did here, see n for solving n, we take y is y one plus y two by two. Two comes here. Four m minus two, six plus three n. Four m minus two m. We substitute what we have got 2 so 8 minus 2 is 6 then we transpose this 6 to this side 6 minus 6 is 0 0 upon anything is 0 so answer is m is 2 and n is 0 kindly pause the video and copy then we will take a couple of more difficult sum so we have a question here children where a uh, center of circle is given minus 2, 5, we have 1, A, so AB is diameter, children. Remember, AB is diameter and C is the center. That means that radii are equal, one circle will have one radius. So what happens, AC is equal to BC. So we can use midpoint formula. So first we have to find length AC children. So here this, see sometimes some question of class 10 you have to remember. Concept of class 9, distance formula. AC is root over what we call x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square. You can take this one as x2, let it be x3, y3 be this. Because I am using x2, let it be x2, y2, let it be x1, y1. Thing is here in distance formula children, same, one side we start. x2 be this, minus 2, minus 3, plus, so this, minus this, so same order, 5 minus 7 is 5 plus 7 square. If we start with this, 3 minus 2, 
ओके थ्री माइनस माइनस टू माइनस सेवन माइनस फाइव सेम वे यू हैव टू गेट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हियर यू कम फ्रॉम हियर ओके सो वाई टू माइनस वाई वा एक्स टू माइनस एक्स वन माइनस टू माइनस थ्री वाई टू माइनस वाई वन रूट ओवर दैट सो दिस इज फाइव स्क्वायर प्लस ट्वेल्व स्क्वायर रूट ओवर दिस इज ट्वेंटी फाइव प्लस वन फोर्टी फोर रूट ओवर वन सिक्सटी नाइन इज थर्टीन सेंटीमीटर सो रेडियस चिल्ड्रेन इज थर्टीन सेंटीमीटर सो रिमेंबर दिस इज डिस्टेंस फार्मूला बट आई थिंक इन टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन चिल्ड्रेन डिस्टेंस फार्मूला वॉज ऑल्सो इन क्लास टेन ओके नाउ इट इज इन क्लास नाइन सो डिस्टेंस फार्मूला वॉज इन क्लास टेन इन टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन ओके सो नेक्स्ट नाउ वी यूज चिल्ड्रेन मिड पॉइंट फॉर्मूला ओके सो वी हैव टू गेट सी दिस आई हैव रिटर्न एक्स वन वाई वन दिस इज एक्स टू वाई टू सो दिस इज माई मिड पॉइंट चिल्ड्रेन एंड दिस इज एक्स थ्री वाई थ्री सो वी हैव टू गेट दिस बी चिल्ड्रेन ओके दिस टू आर इक्वल सो वॉट वी डू इफ वी यूज दिस नेमिंग एक्स टू इज एक्स वन प्लस एक्स थ्री by 2 this we used to call x now i am calling x2 this plus this by 2 so what is x2 children here minus 2 x1 3 plus x3 we have to find by 2 so you bring it over here minus 4 is 3 plus x3 x3 is minus 4 minus 3 minus 7 same way children we will get y3 so for y3 we get y2 midpoint is y1 plus y3 by 2 y2 is 5 y1 is minus 7 5 minus 7 plus y3 by 2 Ten plus seven is y three. Y three is seventeen. So my answer is minus seven and seventeen. This is the coordinate of B. So kindly pause the video and copy. Now we move on to the very last uh, question of this session. So in my part four video, you will see some more harder sum from this exercise eleven of Emil Agrawal's book. So this is a very good question, diagrammatic question. Here we have, we have to find the coordinate of AB. Where listen, children. Midpoint of AB, four minus three. This is the midpoint means they are equal. Let it be. Can take D and take C. So AD is equal to BD. So what we have to find what are the coordinates of A and B. One very important thing, children. A is in x-axis, so the coordinate will be x zero. In the x-axis, y is zero. Y is positive above, negative down. And here, if you see B, B is zero y. Here x is positive. Here x is negative. Here on the y-axis, x is zero, and in the x-axis, y is always zero. Keep this in mind. Okay. In fact, in equation of line, we will see uh, x-axis is called y zero and y-axis is called x zero. So, with this is very important. Then we'll solve for this x and y. So, see a simple application of midpoint formula. Okay. So, like this midpoint four. Okay, is x plus zero. First with first by two. So, x is Eight. Okay, x is eight. Next, for getting y, we take minus three. This is y plus zero by two. Y is minus six. So my a is children eight zero. And this is zero minus six. 
so this is B and this is my A okay so this is your answer you'll write A is 80 and B is 06 so very good question we have some more diagrammatic question you will see where uh, we will do in the part 4 of our section formula so kindly pause the video and copy so thank you children for watching this video lesson